Uh, people said my summary was a lie. <laughs> I'm like, I'm like, hey, yo, what the? <laughs> I'm like, what was a lie? No, 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 no. You don't, people don't want to acknowledge the truth of the matter. And the truth is sometimes that you took money from Jason to shut up. I'm gonna give you $1,500 and you're gonna go and tell him to shut the up. But here's the thing, Walter. If that's all it is, dude, let's end this shit. That's what it was. It was, it was, and I said it without the transcripts, and now you're about to see the transcripts where he counts out $1,500 to give to Walter so Walter can just stop saying that he's blocking him and stop basically trashing his name. And the real beef between Walter and Jason was because Walter was accusing him of blocking him at Comic-Cons. When the, the, fact, the fact of the matter is Walter was under Zach Taylor McGinnis, right? Let me... Like, Henry, you lying. I'm like, I'm a lot of things, guys. A lot of things. A liar. That's a tough, that's a hard sale. Me being, especially something I don't have to lie about, like... I heard the tape, Walter accused Jason of blocking him at cons. When the truth of the matter is his agent allegedly was blocking him at cons. His agent was the middleman to say, hey, my client needs X amount of dollars to show up. And Jason was like, dude, I pay my own way. You don't understand, dude. New York Comic Con, I bought a friend. I pay my own way, dude. I pay my own way to shit. I beg to promoters, and I still do on New York Comic Con. I beg these promoters to be there because I see the long-term gain of it. Gain of it is lying in his summary, dude. You say you got to cite you got to cite your source. Like he, what, what part, what aspect of the story am I lying about? Like if you say someone's lying, say, oh, he's lying about this. This is the lie. Well, what's the lie? What's the lie? Oh, he's just lying. All right, well, then you gotta- Shut up, bitch! This, this is, this is, don't ever call me a liar. <laughs> <laughs> now, I know Brent is gonna screenshot this and be all up in Walter's face. Now, some of this is out of context because the, you know, the, the platform its own only picks up a little bit. So for that portion, where is my notes? I know I got it. The beef started over Walter Jones accusing JDF of blocking my cons. And uh, JDF is upset that Zach Taylor McGinnis is talking shit about him at cons. And when he says, hey, this is this is all JDF right here. I like the guy. The guy is Walter. I'll give you 1500 to never talk ish again. I'm going to give him 1500 and have two witnesses. But calling Salt Lake City and saying I left the show saying that, you know, Jason took an airplane. Francis could vouch for me. Calling on the radio at Salt Lake City saying that I left the show, saying that, you know, Jason took an airplane. It's like, come on, man. And Francis can vouch for me, dude. Just do you. I got no. Oh, <laughs> shit. Francis and gave me the A. Okay. Oh. Oh, look. Let him. Because if she would have said, don't show nothing, I'll just be like, all right, I'll just show what I remember. <laughs> I would I would have respected her wishes. All right. All right. So we going to you going to get the transcripts. And it's only like five pieces of it. Because I'm like, look, guys, I don't have to lie. All right. So when people say I'm lying about stuff, I'm, I take that very, look, call me a lot. You can say, hey, I'm biased. All right, cool, cool, cool. Say uh, I may not like ASJ. Cool, cool, cool. Say I may not like Walter. Cool, cool, cool. But when you say I'm a liar, now you're coming at my credibility. Now you're trying to discredit me because you're about to see the truth. And the truth is, at this Comic-Con, Walter Jones, you, Black Ranger, Took fifteen hundred dollars from Jason David Frank. All right, so say 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 whatever you want to say about that. I'll, you know, go through the horse's mouth. Hey guys, what's up? How you doing? Good, man. How are you? I am blessed and aware. Hope all things are going well with everybody. Listen, I just want to say this. Uh, I I kind of made was made aware of the conversation that was being had. You can't believe everything you hear. Get it straight from the horse's mouth. Don't get it from other people. Well, you, you got to go to see Walter and ask him, did he take the 1500 And if Francis ever released a tape, you will actually hear him count out 1500 to give to him to shut the f up. Sorry. Let, let's let's get into it. Let, let's get into it. I'm the controversial streamer. Let's get controversial up in his 
look, this is Jason David Frank. So you have these pictures right here that show the context, but it's two people talking. It's at Comic-Con. It's very loud. So it's not picking up everything. OK, the, here is from memory, whatever you want to call it. I like the guy. I would give him fifteen hundred to never talk ish about me. I'm going to give him fifteen hundred and have two witnesses. But calling Salt Lake City and saying I left the show saying that, you know, Jason took an airplane. Francis can vouch for me. I'll sit. Look, he said, hey, Walter, I'll send you PayPal. He said, no, he wants cash. So as long as I have a witness, I will pay him because Jason was like, if I give him this money, he can say I never gave it to him. So he made sure he had two witnesses. One person was was Francis. I'm not going to say the other person's name. They could still be in the business and won't know parts of it. Because to be fair, the other person was like, I just want y'all to, to squash this shit. I just want you to squash it. Now, look, they almost came to fucking blows in this because Jason was like, hey, you testing my manhood. And Walter was like, no, I am not doing that. Are you want something too, old man? Huh? No, because, you know, he's he thinking about six flags and shit. I mean, I'm just I'm being facetious. Uh, but but Jason was like, he checked his ass like G checked them hard. Are you testing my manhood? What's that mean? You challenging my manhood? And he was like, no, 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 this is not a threat. He's like, oh, OK, now now, now you speak in my language. Um, and this one, Jason wasn't doing MMA, so he was giving my because the beats and uh, Walter, you know, he's not the, the biggest guy. Um, and we know what happened at Six Flags. So anyway, anyway, anyway I'll, I'll, I said I'll PayPal him. He said, no, he wants cash. So as long as I have a witness, I will pay him. I'm not going to pay him privately. Then he said I didn't pay him. So he knows that, like. If I do pay this guy, is he going to be honest and forthcoming? So he, he said, you know, I said, I'll pay pal. He said, no, I want cash. So as long as I have two witnesses, go, Jason paid you all. That's all I need. I'm not going to pay him privately. Why would I want to pay him privately for him to say he never paid? I just need witnesses. So that's it, dude. But I offered a PayPal and you don't want it. You want cash. So I'm giving cash and you're the only two that knows I paid him. So let's just stop. I'm not asking for peace. OK, I'm asking for him to stop talking ish because my attorney has six other statements saying he is a dirtbag. <laughs> my like, god damn. Here's the thing, man. I, I don't even, I'm not asking for peace. I'm just asking for stop shit talking, dude. Because and everybody from Wizard World and my attorney has like six statements from other top promoters saying he's a dirtbag. He's this. Stop. That's the reason why, like, I'm always like, I don't want to work. So if maybe he's cool, then maybe one day we can all and stop talking shit. And this is all like you're saying. I was like, huh, I like like you. So let's see. Let's put it through challenges. Next time he's at a table, I'll fucking page him, man. He's all good. I talk to him. Let's see. I bet you it won't stop. I bet you it won't stop. Why are you here? Because I said you should come. So they're at a Comic Con and he told him to come. Here's the thing, Walter. You put me on the spot. And Walter is like, y'all blocking me on shows. Look, I'm glad I have you here. This is the other witness to watch him pay. And here's Walter saying, you prevented us from being together. And then Jason is like, look, I want to be clear. Money ain't shit to me. <laughs> I'm tired of him talking ish in the green room about me. Allegedly. Money ain't shit to me, dude. It's just I want it, and I'm not I'm just I, it's not like I want to make peace. I just want to stop, dude. And if this is what it is, cool. Let me feel comfortable when I when I got to go in the green room without him talking to other people and all my friends and other actors and Gary my agent and it has nothing to do you're right but when I get you on a show I start thinking well I gotta work with them uh, it's a green room I think he's gonna have to talk shit to everybody I can't handle it dude it ain't about the money and then he took like this all seems out of context but you're gonna see when you see the screenshots New York Comic Con I paid my own way dude I pay my own way I beg promoters and still do New York Comic Con I said I would PayPal you you said you wanted cash it's two things going on. I imagine Jason is flustered. And the reason is he's like, look, he's like, yo, how'd you get in comic New York Comic Con? He's like, I paid my own way. Why you and your agent is trying to, to strong arm New York Comic Con and say, book us all with these guarantees. And they like, nope, no. Where Jason is like, hey, I'll pay my way. I'll be there. You don't have to put me up. I'll pay for myself to get up. You see, betting on yourself as opposed to asking for someone for, you know, quote unquote, what you're worth. It's two different things. You got to see the long term vision, guys. You got to be like, look, I'm going to do this stream for the Power Ranger community, even though maybe I should probably be doing something else that's going to make me way more money. And then now you're just doing it for money and you, you're not passionate about it. So where he's like, look, I, I see the long term. I'm passionate about spending time with my fans. OK, this is the biggest one of the biggest Comic Cons out here. OK, they're not giving me a guarantee. They're not paying for me a flight. They're not getting my hotel. How about this promoter? 
I'll pay for my own flight. I'll pay for my own hotel. I'll even buy a booth if that's what you want too. And you don't even have to worry about me. Whereas other people's like, you ain't paying for my flight. I need a per diem for me. I need a per diem for my agent. I need a first class flight. I need a, a five star hotel. And they like, they like, who are you to be asking for all this sh when you're unproven? And it's just like, wait a minute. Are you? Are you Walter Jones? This New York Comic Con. You want to do Comic Con? You better fucking sack up and put five of y'all at one booth. <laughs> you you want you want us to pay you? They like uh uh. Nope. No no. Comic Con sh works cool when you in Orlando, when you at Lexicon. That shit fly there, but here at New York Comic Con, we got the big dogs here. We got William Shatner here. We got the we got the people who play in X Men. We got Guardians of the Galaxy here. That shit don't fly at New York, brother. So look, you want to come? You we we gotta you, you gotta have to figure some shit out. All right, you want to come as a guest? We'll throw you some tickets. So he's complaining about that. Jason, like, look, this is how you got to do it. But Walter ain't trying to hear all that. Okay, now look, JDF asks for Austin number. Well, he counts out the money. <laughs> he counts out the money. Four, one, one, two, three, four, two, one, two, three, four, three, one, two, three, four, four, one, two, three, four, five, one, two. Um, and look, guys, I'm paraphrasing, and you know, you know, Aaron Corny, like he's a fucking liar. You wasn't even. In there so how would you know i'm a liar see that's what you got to think about you are like wait 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 aaron said you was a liar yeah was aaron there no so how was he saying i'm a liar if he wasn't there because walter said you, you a liar oh okay all right all right whatever now look <laughs> now like you know after they get past that you know he's like look where i need austin's number because they want to do the fight all this other good stuff hey i want and then Walter, like a little bitch, he's like, dude, I text you. You ain't text me back. He like, <laughs> hey, yo, what the f wait, what? I text you and you ain't text me back. And I tweeted at you to let you know I was looking forward to hanging out with you. He's like, hey, yo, what the f dude, I text you back. And so now you got this miscommunication and Walter acting like some little ex-girlfriend reaching out to the boyfriend. Like, why you ain't read my text? He like, is, is, is that what this? about i didn't text you back are you serious and look guys this look you think i'm joking you think i'm joking go hear from the horse's mouth and say hey did you get upset that jason didn't text you back he gonna be like uh who, who, you, you heard that from that Henry guy i don't know why you believe him man Nick, answer the question yes or no <laughs> that's what it, that's what you should say yes or no press his ass press up on him hey yes or no did you get mad at jason for not texting you back yeah, don't be <laughs> you want to take a picture answer the question sorry anywho um all right, all right, all right, all right. walter i said after con i want to hang out after con uh they go back and forth about texting jdf said you know i sent you something walter said i tweeted at you jdf said i didn't get it i have known you for like 20 years <laughs> all right like look man <laughs> It is a girlfriend move. And look, I'm cooking. I'm going to get to that super chat as soon as I finish cooking. Uh, look, look, look. Then he starts talking about like JDF talks about the grind, guys. He talks about the fucking grind. He like, guys, look, man, I beg these promoters to be in shows. I go do I go do contests for free, whereas you may charge. I'll be around. Nothing happened. They would make you do a one-time thing, but they would not. Dude, I just now got first class. You cheap about I paid my own way to bed for five shows. I'll do the costume contest. No extra money. That's all I did. And no, I got my cool. name in. But what I'm saying is they're 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 a hard con. And, and Zach told you this to get in. So it's not like I'm blocking anybody. It's like, hey, you I go do that shit for free. I did a co a, a cosplay costume event just for free. You want to charge for this. You want to charge for that. Promoters don't like that shit. And we walked like, well, I got kids to feed. He like, you don't fucking get it. You don't get it. And you, if you don't get it now, you never going to get it. You got to do the free shit. The free 
shit is what gets you in the door. And then once you get the audience, then you run their pockets. Don't run their pockets before you get in the door. Look, uh, I, uh, I, I know business, but I'm like, this is what you do. Hey, I did a college internship. Hey, college internship led to a job. I did the fucking internship for free. You know why? So at the end of the internship, they offered me a high paying job. Why don't you get this shit? Well, you know, well, I was paid this much at Comic Con. Shut up, bitch. Look. I'm trying to put you on game, Lil. Uh, I'm the king of Comic Con for a reason. I am the king for a reason. I do shit for free. If I'm the king and I'm doing shit for free, why the f you charging? Sorry, sorry about the language. Sorry. All right. Anyway, uh, anyway, uh, getting back to it. Um, hey, you blocked me and Johnny Young Boss. Just Walter saying it. Um, JDF, I told Dave to come. Zach wouldn't let Dave come because he said it was too much drama. Remember, Zach was on some book all of us or none of us. You know, this guy right here, book us all or don't book none. OK, and at some point when they fell out with JDF, it was book us and not JDF or some like that. Vice versa. Who, 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 who knows? This is where this is where you go left. He's like, yo, you challenging my manhood? <laughs> you challenging my manhood? Because look. It was getting heated. This can't keep happening if you expect me to be cool with it. What's that mean? You challenging my manhood? Um, and then he's like, no, it's not a threat. He's like, oh, okay. Because I thought we was at Six Flags in this bitch. And, you know, we, we had turned up. Uh, JDF said, look, I want to do a show. Walter said, put your money where your mouth is and put me on a show. So, look, you see Walter is like, is constantly like, put me on a show. Walter, like, look, I have two kids to flee, feet, so don't block me from shows. JDF is like, stick to your agent and I'll stick to mine. Carried away, stick to your agent and I'll stick to mine. To be honest, man, I'm over blaming me this whole crap. Please leave me alone. It's not my fault, man. We just talked and you said to ask me. So can you help the members of the cast and not me? I have embraced you over the years again. True. I've helped you with doll talk and supported, cheered you on. True. And now I come to you to ask as a friend, not to hurt me. This is your reply. Oh, my kids are being a joke. I'm taking money out of my pocket. I didn't text you back. You, your manager works for you. You don't work for him. Zach, Zach does exactly what that is. You have the control. Do the right thing, man. Dude, I've never asked anything wrong to you. I'm a good person. And you are really, you're really that selfish? <clears throat> Boom, balls in your court. Selfish, really? Okay, man. I help a lot of fucking people. That's my recap. When you see the transcripts, someone said that's enough, Henry. <laughs> Look, I am cooking. I, I be getting passionate about it. this. Is the PayPal, you know, blah, blah, blah. You're only two that knows I paid them. So let's let's stop so we can just, you know, I appreciate what you're doing. I think Walter is right. This is the this is the third person. Walter is right. Walter did want to like squash the beef, but at the same time, Walter did want money. <laughs> so it's like, <laughs> like <laughs> You want you want to squash the beast and you want money? Uh, you guys should be able to like f you guys. Here's the thing though, dude. But you don't understand, dude. New York Comic Con. I Francis knows I paid my own way, dude. I pay my own way to fucking. I beg promoters and still do New York Comic Con. I my own for you to yet, but I pay my own way. And when I get like you're at it about not to be easy for you to do, I have to. Oh, oh. This is where Walter says you're wealthy and it's easy for you to pay your own way. I have two kids and I can't afford to fly them with me. I mean, that's a Walter problem. That's not a JDF problem. If you want to do New York Comic Con and you have to pay your own way to get in there, it is what it is. <laughs> it is what it is. So this is where he pays out the goddamn money. You see, they, this, 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 this. You know, I thought I saw extra. That's my way. Someone, the dude cracked the joke who was watching him pay out the money. He was like, I thought you put in a little bit of extra. <laughs> he was like, uh, he was like, maybe you should double count that. Like being facetious or whatever, right? <laughs> All right. She says she want me to stop. She's like, stop that. <laughs> All right. Francis says stop. I'll respect their wishes. Now, look, I was about to go off on the deep end, but you know. I know you were. You were about to. I was about to. Look, she, you, sa you saved him so much. Luckily, I was reading but, the chat. Was, everyone's but, like, Henry, stop. Henry, stop. I'm like, oh, all right. What was going on? All right, all right. She says. You guys love I, each other. You know, the thing is, man, like, I'm going to be really honest with you, man. Like, there ain't no beef in Boston, dude. 